This question is from gate 2016. Mechanical engineering paper set 1. Question number 6. A rigid ball of weight 100 Newton is suspended with the help of a string. The ball is pulled by a horizontal force F such that the string makes an angle of 30 degree with the vertical. The magnitude of force F in Newton is. Now at this instant in this system we know that weight of the rigid ball is acting downwards which is of 100 Newton. Force F is being applied in order to give this angular displacement of 30 degree and because this rigid ball is tied to the string there will be a tension in the string. So let's draw the free body diagram of this mass. Here's the rigid ball. All the forces that are in this system are shown here. Horizontal force F, weight W which is given as 100 Newton and tension in the string let that be T. Also we have this angle is 30 degree hence if we consider a right angle triangle over here this angle can be determined with the horizontal it is 60 degrees. Now by using the equation of equilibrium we will start with the known quantity. So the known value is a vertical force this being the x direction and this being the y direction then we can write summation of forces in y direction equal to 0 by equation of static equilibrium hence vertical component of t which is t sin theta t sin theta is upward so positive plus t sin theta minus downward force of 100 newton which is the weight is equal to 0 from this we have theta here is 60 degrees and sin 60 is root 3 by 2 so if we put the value of sin 60 we have t is equal to 100 upon root 3 by 2. So we have t as 200 by root 3. Now we need to find force F. So we will use summation of forces in x direction equal to 0. Another equation of static equilibrium gives us this. And in this case we have a positive F force. So we will write plus F and co horizontal component of T acts in the negative x direction. Hence we will write minus t cos 60 degree is equal to 0. We need to find f. We have t from here. Let's just put it here. We have f is equal to t cos theta putting the value of t 200 by root 3 into cos 60 value is 1 by 2. So the answer that we have is 100 upon root 3 by digital calculator if you calculate this value, it turns out to be 57.735 Newton. Let's fill in the answer. So the magnitude of force F in Newton is 57.735. To learn equilibrium equations in detail, you can refer to the NPTEL video, Module 1, Lecture 2, Equilibrium 1. It is from the course Lecture Series on Engineering Mechanics by Professor Manoj Harbola. He is from Department of Physics, IIT Kanpur. I hope this solution will help you clear your doubt. Thank you.